Hello and welcome to Console Accessories. Another video for you today. And I hope you're staying safe. And I hope you're looking after each other. And let's have a little bit of a distraction for a few minutes, shall we? And what we're going to do now is look at the four classiest cases you can buy for your Nintendo Switch. Last week I did a video on the classiest cases for the Switch Lite, and I shall link it up there. That went down really well, and people asked me, it's all well and good to get the Switch Lite, I can't fit my Switch in it, so have we got any for the Switch? So I tasked Mrs. Console Accessories to find four of the classiest ones she could find. She's done me proud, and we're just gonna go through them now, okay? So I've got my Switch here, I've got my Switch Lite just to see if it fits in there because this is hers. But I wanted to do it for the Switch. So let's crack on. And if you like this video, stick a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new around here, it would mean the world to me. Okay, so the first one is the Moco pouch. Okay, so this is it. Now I'm gonna I'm not gonna weigh all these, but I'm gonna weigh this one. So let's take the let's take the plastic off just to show you look. It's 57 grams, there's nothing to it. Uh, I'm not gonna weigh them all. I just wanted to show you how light this thing is. Um, okay, so this is the cheapest out of them all. This was eight pounds in the UK, and I can't find this in the UK. And I think I know why the reason is why it's so cheap. Um, if you just wanted a piece of felt to wrap around your switch, then this is the one for you, okay? It's got a, I, I don't think that's leather, but I think it's something stitched onto there. That's not too bad. And then you open it up. This is not great. Um, the Velcro here is not brilliant, but you get space for one, two, three, four, five Switch games. Nice. And then inside, that's not too bad at all. Okay, so it's not it's not bad. It's just a kind of just just a piece of felt that's been machined, isn't it? Uh, let's put this, there's no protection at all for the Switch, but this is console accessories. Walls and bothered about protection at all. So, but she liked that because it's nice and slim. Uh, she could just shove that in her handbag. She loved it. And then for obvious reasons, you can fit the switch light in there. And she did like that because it had room for other stuff in there. The switch light down the side. Okay. So that's your first one. That's eight quid. That's the cheapest of the lot. It's it just feels felt really. I don't know what much more to say about it. It's eight quid for a reason. Okay. So there we go, there's your first one. Now, here we go. And now this is the second one. This is the Pro Case. And it's a little bit different. It's the same kind of, it's, it's, it's felt, but it feels a little bit different. This feels kind of, this feels a little bit more, more quality. And it's got a nice button on there with a nice attachment on it. And one, two, three, four, five, enough for five games. And it's a beautiful inside, so we get a thank you card. It's got a lovely feel to that. That's almost suede, that's lovely, that's really nice in fact. And the reason she got this one, exactly the same reasons. She said it would just fit into the bag, easy. And it's nice and thin, and it looks nice as well. They do this one in a few colours. To be fair, they do this one in a few colours. But So they do this one in a few colours, they do it in blue, and I think they do it in a pink, and they do it in a grey as well. So I think if you wanted, if you did want to get a pink one, I'd probably get this in pink ones, or a grey one. But the blue looks a lot nice. There's no extra padding. I mean, if you can hear that, I'm pressing the buttons of the switch. Pro case label on the side there. It's a nice little addition having that label on there. It just means they've just added that little bit of extra quality to it. But it feels really good. The, the stitching feels really good. I mean, I don't know. See, yeah, you can see the stitching in there, but it, yeah, it feels really nice. So this one's this one's this one's a winner for, for me. Um, this costs ten pounds in the UK and fourteen dollars in the US. And if you want a nice little sleep, put fire in your bag. Perfect. Obviously, these will all fit the switch light, but again, she likes it. I think she'll probably keep one of these because she can stick stuff in there as well and have that in her bag and it doesn't scream, I've got a Nintendo Switch on me. Okay, that's good. Okay, next up, it's, we're going up in price a little bit. So that one was eight pounds, or um, can't find it in the US. And this one was 10 pounds and $14. And then we're gonna go up to this one. 
Okay, so this is box, this one. This doesn't just come in a, a wrapper. The reason we got this was, again, nice and slim and a couple of extra zips here, which, which she was interested in. So let's have a look. And this is the Sisma case. And let's get rid of that. And there we go, look at this. So it comes with a wrist strap if you want it. Is there a specific place for the wrist strap? Yeah, there we go, on the end there. Put that wrist strap and then you put your switch in there. And that is lovely. I mean, that's really nice quality and good padding as well. This was 14 pounds in the UK, it's $16. I'm really liking this, I'm really liking this. So switch goes in. Got another pouch there. Oh, it's the games are one, two, three, four, five games can fit in there. And some extra bits. Couple of zips. She wasn't too fond of the zips. She didn't really want anything that had zips on it, but made an exception for this one because of, but she didn't mind. And then a wrist strap there. So you can carry it and then a slot there for anything. I'm not sure what you'd want to put in there, but this is really good. This is really good quality. And as you can say, it's a step up in quality from these two, which seem to be just bits of felt that have been machined. A step up in quality, but a step up in price. It's nearly double this. Worth it? Yeah, I'd say so. Really good, really good protection as well. There's really good protection because it's nice and padded. Okay, so this is the ultra slim carrying case from Sisma. 14 pounds or 16 dollars. Let's whack a switch light in there, shall we? Yeah, easy. Again, size down there. This this would be great for a switch switch light because this isn't it's not gonna rattle around because of the the quality padding that holds it together. So I think the switch light crack in. I really love that. That's a lovely feel. All right, okay, so there we go, there's that one. That's nice. And then the final one we're gonna go for is this one. Now, this is the Fun Lab case. How do you like this? Because I had a picture of that Snorlax, isn't it? But there's absolutely no mention of it on here. Okay, and the reason was, for obvious reasons, it just looks nice. It's really good quality. This, I don't think this is going to be leather. No, I don't think it's leather. Pleather, or whatever the word is called. It's fastened with magnets. One, two, three, four, five games. Bits in there, get rid of them. And just feels really nice. Nice, thick quality. Again, I don't think it's going to offer too much protection. It's not bad, actually. The protection isn't too bad actually because of the leather. There's no padding, so there's no there's no padding like this one. But it's certainly going to need more protection than these two because these are two are soft and this one's a lot harder because of this material here. Perfect fit for the switch as you'd expect. Nothing else. No hand strap. It would have been nice if there'd have been like a hand strap in there because I know one of the other ones we looked at for the um, switch light. It had a hand strap on the back there, which was quite nice. But she chose this because it just looked nice. And again, she just loves it to be able to easily slip in because a lot of my cases I've got are really big and really chunky and they're just, they're just a nightmare. So you have to kind of have them as a standalone, whereas these ones fit nicely. And there it goes, look. That's a nice colour match, isn't it, for that. Put stuff down there. Bits and bobs in there. Games, but stick up little stuff in there. Really classy, like this one a lot. Okay, so what's your favorite then? I think, I think we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to decide. I think I'm gonna bin this one. I think I'm gonna bin this pink one. It's just not very good. Okay, it's, it's gonna break. And if you particularly wanted pink, I would be going for this one in pink anyway. I think this is a step up from that one. I think if you like the if you like the look of this one and you don't want anything that looks like Snorlax or you don't want anything that does look like a, a case because I'd say this one looks more like a case, I think this one 
and this was only $14 or £10. And then the Snorlax one, really nice leather quality, but doesn't offer much more than just to be housing your Switch. Whereas this one has a few extra pouches and stuff. Okay, so when I asked this console accessories, which one we're we gonna send back, she agreed, we're gonna send this one back. She was also gonna send this one back because it was just too much for her. She wanted to put it in her bag, despite the fact that there's extra packaging in there. And it was between these two. And when pushed, she went for this one. Okay, she did like this one. She liked the leather look of this one. But this one just won her over. It was the, just the simplicity of the look. The fact that you just opened it up. Love the inside. Again, in case it didn't bother a lot of it, it's digital. And she loved the fact that when she puts us put light in, as with all of them, she could also put some extra stuff in. So this one was the winner, which is a bit of luck, it was the second cheapest, £10 or $14. I'll leave a link below to all of these. So I want you to comment, tell me which one's your favourite. Which one's your favourite? I think this one is definitely my favourite. It just looks classy, doesn't it? It's just classy. It doesn't look like a switch case. It just looks like a, just a classy, classy piece especially with the button and the elastic going around it. Yeah, really good. So what's your favorite? Is it the pink, the gray, the Snorlax or the blue one? You've got a blue one is superb, isn't it? Okay, so do comment below. Let me know your favorites. Let me know if you're gonna pick any of these up if you want them, but I'll link to them below so you can go and grab yourself one. Um, I hope you're staying safe. I hope you're looking after each other. Um, please do thumbs up this video. It would be much appreciated and subscribe if you're new around here. It would be ever so much appreciated. Okay, and until the next video then, bye-bye.